G'day guys and welcome to the first instalment of our mobility videos being the foot release with our trigger point ball. Over the next few weeks and subsequent videos, we're going to be showing you a lot of mobility tips and trigger point releases using trigger point ball, travel foam roller and a simple power band. Okay, so first up we have a foot release. Now, nasty little bit of kit this, if we have tight feet, uh, running, excessive standing throughout the day, wearing high heels, that fascia on the bottom of the feet gets quite tight and bound up. If we want to complete activities like running, squatting, anything high intensity or movement based, we want to make sure that fascia on the bottom of the foot is nice and released and ready to go for activity. So we're simply just going to stand on that ball. We're going to move nice and slow around the foot, trying to find any trigger points throughout the foot. So the moment we find one, we're going to spend a bit of time on that one spot and we're just going to conduct some breathing. In through the nose and out through the nose. Relaxing, not putting too much pressure on if it is quite touchy, as it can be from some people. Uh, and what we're looking for is working along the medial aspect, so again, along the line of your big toe and then the subsequent lines along your toes as well. So there's the, the main aspects we need to look for here is that line with the big toe, the first metatarsal, and anywhere else it might be carrying tension. You might notice you might have more tension on the outside of your foot, so we're simply going to shift our weight onto the outside of our foot and run down that line back towards our heel. Nice and slow, not too quick, like I said, not too much pressure on the foot if it is a bit tender. Okay, remember to breathe and then just walk around that foot with that ball, trying to find the sore spots to release. Okay, there you have it guys, both feet, spend a good two to three minutes on each foot at least to help improve that tissue elasticity on the bottom of your foot, and then combining that with some ankle mobility drills and our big toe mobility, we're really starting to get those feet ready for activity. Thanks very much.